In this video, we will demonstrate the UART protocol trigger. Using the protocol trigger makes it easier to trigger a particular UART command. We'll start by adding a protocol decoder. Then we go into the menu Acquisition and select Protocol Trigger. The interface is divided into tabs. In the first tab, we are going to define our command. In this example, we would like to trigger the data 1F. With no parity. And followed by a stop. At the bottom of the dialog box, there is a preview area displaying the summary of the command we just defined. Let's click on OK and Capture. We can see we have trigger on the command defined in the protocol trigger menu. Going back to the dialog box. As we said, it is divided into 16 tabs. We have only used the first tab so far, but if we open the second tab, we see it is possible to define another command. All of them forming a sequence. So it is possible to trigger a sequence of 16 commands. Let's add another command in our sequence. Second command is in the value 2f, no parity, and is ended by stop. Click on OK and capture. We can see that the trigger bar is placed on the stop of the second command, as expected. That was a demonstration of the UART protocol trigger.